Hello everyone again and welcome to my channel. This is Mr. Nasser and today we will um, have a new lesson about eating out. Okay. Uh, in this lesson, we will learn when you go to a restaurant and you sit on the table and the first thing you do, you ask for the menu. So you can see what you want to eat or drink. Okay. And how you ask about uh, prices, how you give money, all of these things. When the waiter come to you, what the waiter will say, what you will say. Okay, everything we will learn today in this lesson. Okay, so before we start, okay, before we start, here we have um, a few questions. Exercise number one. When do you usually eat out? <clears throat> For example, um, I eat out on Saturdays. I work every day and on Saturday <clears throat> I go out with my family. I eat out. But in the week, no, I don't. So what about you? Tell me. When do you usually eat out? Okay, so... What about <clears throat> question number two? What's your favorite cafe or restaurant? Um, some people go, for example, to uh, here in, in Istanbul, we have Mado, uh, Starbucks, cafe. So which is your uh, favorite and restaurant? Which is your favorite? Which restaurant you, you like to go always and eat from? Okay. Three, is it cheap or expensive? We talk about the cafe or restaurant. Is it cheap or expensive? What do you usually eat there? Do you eat sandwiches? Do you take meals? Burger? What? Okay. So this exercise is a speaking exercise. If you work with a, <clears throat> a partner, so you can uh, make a nice conversation here, ask and answer. So exercise number two, here we will move to the uh, menu. So here we have the menu. In the menu we'll have food, drinks and desserts. Desserts is like sweet. Okay, and here <clears throat> we have some photos for food, drinks, desserts. We will match these photos, okay, with the menu. For example, let's start with number one. Number one, let's look at the photo clearly. Hmm. So this is number one. It's a sandwich. What's in the sandwich? We have tomato, we have cheese. So <clears throat> let's go to the menu. And we see sandwiches. We have egg mayonnaise or cheese and tomato. Mm. So this is cheese and tomato. So we should write <clears throat> number one here. Okay, guys. So now you will stop the video for two, three minutes. Do the exercise. Okay. Then we will check together. Okay, here's the screen. <clears throat> okay, so here we have, uh, we will go to the other page. Here we have page 136. Okay, this is vocabulary 4.5. Uh, 36 let's write it 136 4.5 mm -hmm. okay so here's the exercise <clears throat> no, no 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 sorry okay so here we have the exercise food and drink okay 
pizza, burger and chips, french fries, cheeseburger and chips, a tuna salad, chicken salad, mixed salad, hair, an egg, my, uh, an egg mayonnaise sandwich, cheese and tomato sandwich, apple pie with the cream, fruit salad, vanilla, strawberry, chocolate ice cream, tea and coffee, a glass of white wine, a bottle of red wine, a bottle of beer, a bottle of still mineral water, a bottle of sparkling mineral water. Okay, so let's go back. Of course, here we will have the answer. So if you want to check. Okay, you can check here the answers. <clears throat> okay, so let's go and see the pronunciation of these uh, words because we have some problems here. Look guys, here we have pizza, pizza, margarita or Neapolitan. Okay, these are names, don't worry about them. Burger, burger and chips, cheeseburger and chips. Tuna, tuna, chicken, mixed. Uh, this word here, we don't say D at the end. We don't say mixed, D. no. We make it like this. Okay, we say mixed. We say mixed, mixed, okay? This is how we say the word. We say mixed, mixed. Okay, guys, be careful with this. Uh, red, egg mayonnaise, cheese and tomato. Um, maybe some of you say teacher is tomato, not tomato. Okay, tomato, British accent, tomato, American accent. So no problem. If you say tomato, you say tomato, no problem. Apple pie with the cream, <clears throat> fruit salad, vanilla, chocolate or strawberry ice cream, red, white wine. Uh, wine is the grape juice, but after that they make it with alcohol. So here it's wine is alcohol, glass or bottle. Maybe some books, face-to-face uh, -face elementary, second edition books, uh, they don't have wine, they have orange juice. Okay, so no problem. Bottle of beer, here bottle of uh, water, bottle of mineral water, <clears throat> still or sparkling. Um, still or sparkling, normal water, we, we take normal water, and uh, this is we say still. For other people, some people are sick, some people have problem in their stomach, so they take water with gas, the same uh, Coca-Cola, but it's water, okay? So with gas, we say sparkling, sparkling, tea or coffee, okay? So again here, margarita, Neapolitan, burger and chips, burger and chips, cheeseburger and chips, cheeseburger and chips, tuna, tuna, chicken, chicken, mixed, mixed, so tuna salad, we don't say salad, tuna, no, tuna salad, chicken salad, mixed salad, okay, sandwiches, ah, uh, here, it's very important, mm, I will mark it, San, okay, D is silent, guys, D is silent, we don't say D, San, which, San, which, you can say San, which, J or Ch, sandwich, sandwich, no problem, Iki, uh, two are correct, okay, sandwich, sandwich, sandwiches, egg mayonnaise, 
cheese and tomato desserts desserts apple pie with the cream fruit salad here we have vanilla ice cream chocolate ice cream strawberry ice cream red wine white wine bottle of beer bottle of beer bottle of mineral water bottle of mineral water still mineral water sparkling mineral water tea or coffee we all know tea and coffee okay so here I want to go when I go to a restaurant and before I ask for food I ask for uh, price maybe I have some money and I want to know uh, can I buy this food or no so I say how much is so this is the question here how much is after that what do you want to eat uh, for example a tuna salad and a bottle of mineral water okay so now for example now you come to a restaurant and you are very very hungry and this is the menu okay this is the menu and now you will ask <clears throat> just a minute You would ask a question, which is how much is, okay? And what do you want to ask for? Uh -huh. One, two, three, four th uh, things. For example, how much is a uh, Neapolitan pizza? Uh, cheese, uh, cheeseburger and chips, mixed salad, and a uh, bottle of mineral water. So you write them. <coughs> uh, try to practice how you ask about uh, price. Okay, so you write how much is and everything because you want the total okay the total uh, price and the answer will be like it's maybe like uh, 35 uh, like dollars or euros or whatever okay so this is how you ask before you eat okay now let's go to Exercise number four, help with listening, would you like? We use would you like for offers, listen and notice how we say would you in question, in questions. So would you, the same meaning, um, <clears throat> do you want? okay it's the same meaning but uh would you like is nice okay guys so do you want and would you like uh someone come to your home so you say would you like to drink uh would you like for example to drink coffee would you like to drink tea don't say do you want <clears throat> and here you expect to hear, you usually hear. <coughs> we did this exercise before. Here, you usually hear what how people speak in the street. And how people speak in the class. Okay? So, this is you expect to hear, 
you think people will talk like this, but no, they don't talk like this, they talk like this, okay? Let's listen. Mm -hmm. Let's listen. Track 75. Listen to what you expect to hear and what you usually hear. Would you? Would you? Would you like to order now? Would you like to order now? Okay, guys, so if you notice here, we say would you, would you, here we say would you, would you, would you, would you, don't say would you, here we say would you like to order now, would you like, would you, d, j, d, j, d, J together guys okay so we say would you would you like would you would you like would you like would you like would you like to order now would you like to order now people don't say would you like to order no so this is now you learn and you practice people listen to you see huh very nice accent okay maybe your level is elementary but your accent is very nice. Okay, guys, so we say, would you, would you, would you, would you like, would you like, would you like. Try to practice for one, two days after that, you find easy. You always say, would you like, would you like, would you like. Okay, now, here we will listen and put these questions in order. You hear them. So here we have four questions. You listen. What's question number one? What's question number two, three and four? Okay. Track 76. What would you like to drink? Would you like a dessert? Would you like tea or coffee? Would you like anything else? Okay, guys, so we check. So one is D, two C, three A, four B. <clears throat> okay, guys, so now we will watch a video about these nice people here. We have uh, Paul and Claire. They are in the restaurant here. And this is the waiter. <clears throat> okay. So now what uh, we will do, look here at the exercise. Close your books. Watch or listen. Now we will watch to Paul and Claire at the Sun Cafe. What do they order? Okay. For example, pizza. Uh, Claire orders pizza. Uh, Paul orders uh, cheese and tomato sandwich. Okay. So write them in a list for Claire and for Paul. Okay. Food and a drink, food and a drink. Okay, guys, let's watch. This is a nice place. Yes, it is, isn't it? I hear the burgers are very good here. Mm. The salads look good too. Oh, it's difficult to decide. Yes. The chicken salad, I think. Would you like to order now? Yes, I'd like the chicken salad, please. Can I have the cheeseburger and chips, please? What would you like to drink? We'd like a bottle of mineral water, please. Still or sparkling? Sparkling, please. Would you like anything else? 
No, that's all, thanks. Would you like a dessert? Yes, I'd like the fruit salad, please. And can I have the apple pie with cream? Certainly. Would you like tea or coffee? Not for me, thank you. No, thank you. Can we have the bill, please? Yes, of course. No, don't worry, Claire. Let me pay for this. Are you sure? Yes, of course. OK. Here's a tip. Okay, guys, so, guys, if you want to watch again, <clears throat> you can watch again and uh, write the list, okay? No problem. You watch again uh, once, twice, three times, no problem, okay? So, here, let's check the answers. So, for Paul and Claire, order a chicken salad. A cheeseburger and chips, a bottle of sparkling mineral water, fruit salad, apple pie with cream. Okay. <clears throat> now here in exercise number six, read Paul and Claire's conversation with the waitress. Fill in the gaps with the questions from 4B. So this is the same. Uh, conversation from the video but here we have four questions waitress question number one waitress question number two waitress question number three waitress question number four okay so let's see here the questions so the questions we will take from here these are the four questions okay and here you will write question okay which one is in the correct place for example you say here would you like to order now yes I like the chicken salad please can I have the cheeseburger and chips please uh, so here what do we write for example we say would you like tea or coffee or would you like anything else would you like a dessert? What would you like to drink? Okay. So you have the book. Stop the video. Okay. Two minutes. Fill in the gaps. Then we will check together, guys. Mm. It's better like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, after you finish, you can watch the video again and check. But here we have the answers. Okay, one, two, three, four. These are the answers. And here, guys, we have a word. Maybe some people ask, what's this? Certainly. Um, when I ask you, I say, uh, for example, um, a qu this is a question. Mm, can I have the apple pie with the cream? I say, sure, of course, certainly. All the same meaning. So, certainly is very, very nice. And like high class. You say, certainly. Okay, sure, of course, the same meaning. Certainly, 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 okay? So, now maybe you are with uh, a friend, you study with a friend or a friend or you study um, on your own. It's a good idea to practice this conversation, okay? Uh, read it many times. And... Um, 
this audio like every uh, time try to watch the video again and again this is very good way why because now you have a video maybe two or three minutes and you know all the words in the video uh, the words are in your level uh, they are not difficult you can uh, say them and you have the <clears throat> script here okay you can read and uh, and watch so if you watch again and again and again it's very good idea okay <clears throat> now let's move to the real word here <clears throat> request and offer request when you ask people to give you something this is request offer i give people they don't ask but i give them okay request in the restaurant you ask the waiter to come say please uh, excuse me and they come then you ask what you want you ask this is a request maybe you are uh, sitting on the table and the waiter comes to you and they say uh, would you like to order now so do you want anything so this is offer okay and now we will learn how to use offer and request let's go here and look So, which sentences is an offer? Okay. And here, which sentences are requests? So, we say, look at the sentences, one, two, three. Which sentences are requests? We want something. Which sentences is an offer? We want to give something or help to someone. Okay. So, which one do you think? Request. Which one do you think an offer? Mm -hmm. okay let's check mm. so look here uh, one we say would you like to order now this is offer because the waiter comes to you offer I'd like and we would like a bottle of mineral water, please. We ask. So this is a request. Okay, so let's write it here. Offer. Okay. And here, we'll write R. Request. Three, can I uh, or can we have the bill, please? So now we request. So it's request. The answer here in the book, I don't know, it's wrong. Okay. So we say one is offer, two and three is request. Now complete the rules with the phrases in bold in 7a. 7a here these just these okay we fill in the gaps here for example we use and for request what do we use mm -hmm. okay so we use for request i uh, i'd or weed like okay so this is and <clears throat> say uh, can I or we you can talk about yourself you talk about you and your group together we have now you ask for things so these are for requests then we have
I'd like or we would like. Uh, sorry, we say, uh, would you like? Or offer. Would you like? We use it for offer. Okay. So, guys, again, if you want to ask something, you use two and three. You want to help someone. Uh, you use number one, would you like? Okay, here <clears throat> we have um, the stress. Where do we put the stress usually? For example, you say, would you like to order now? Would you like to order now? So here we have stress on like, order, and now. Yes, I'd like the chicken salad, please. So here stress is important in, uh, in British accent. Yes, because if you speak like uh, <clears throat> normally, Languages they speak flat. They say, for example, here we say, Would you like to order now? Would you like to order now? So it's flat. In a British accent, usually they say, Here, for example, the stress like order now. Would you like to order now? So you have to go up and down, up and down. Then you say, Yes, I'd like. The chicken salad, please. So, uh, step by step, now you understand that the uh, the language, British accent, you have you go up, down, up, down. Stress, important words, uh, important words have stress. Uh, you say clear, strong, okay? And we talked about this before. Uh, when we talked about the um, uh, car rental, uh, you remember Paul was in a an airport, and uh, the woman asked um, asks him uh, personal details. Uh, what's your surname, please? Uh, and what's your nationality? We studied this before. Okay, so here. Uh, it's a good idea to practice if you want, okay? I will play the recording. Track 79. Would you like to order now? Yes, I'd like the chicken salad, please. Can I have the cheeseburger and chips, please? What would you like to drink? We'd like a bottle of mineral water, please. Would you like anything else? Would you like a dessert? Yes, I'd like the fruit salad, please. And can I have the apple pie with cream? Would you like tea or coffee? Okay, guys, so um, try to practice many times, not once or twice or three times. No, <clears throat> try to practice again and again and again. After that, naturally, maybe you are in a restaurant and um, the waiter talks to you and you would answer with stress, okay? It's very nice because you practice, 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 and it's copied here, okay? So uh, when you have the same situation, you answer naturally, okay? It's very nice, but you need to practice a lot, okay? Mm. Uh, 
guys if you are uh, <clears throat> if you study like a group or you and your partner it's a good idea to practice uh, we said practice the conversation uh, try you now take a piece of paper and try to imagine that you and your friend in a restaurant and you order food write the conversation write the conversation uh, for example I write Nasser Ahmed and uh, the waiter or waitress okay uh, what I order what I say what my friend uh, says what uh, the water uh, the, the waiter uh, says it's very good idea taking information taking information will not help you speaking uh, the English okay now you have uh, here we studied all of this information we studied uh, the menu uh, food drink desserts how to ask about uh, prices how you talk with the waiter how you order how you request okay so all of this information now you have so what you do with this information can you use this information or no so of course now no because you need to practice how you practice um, because maybe you don't have to, uh, people to talk English with so you write okay make a conversation after that try to say the conversation okay uh, try to be you your friend and the waiter and you talk okay it's very good idea uh, in the past I did this I talk I have a chair in my room I always talk to the chair okay I make conversation I, I, I imagine I say maybe um, my chair ask me this question I answer I ask so you need someone to talk to if you don't have you need to find something okay guys so that's it for uh, the lesson today uh, again guys if you have any question uh, about anything even uh, the uh, lessons before any grammar uh, difficult you, you you don't understand just write on the comment okay and we will uh, make a video about it so and uh, I have good news I will start making uh, live videos so maybe in the future if you uh, study, you have some questions, okay? Uh, we can chat together and answer all the questions, okay? Again, guys, please, any questions, just send it to the comment, send it to uh, my what's uh, number, WhatsApp number, okay? And I will answer as soon as possible. Okay, guys, thank you for watching and goodbye.